Hello everyone, you know some footballers enjoy a rainy day, not sure fans always feel that way, but an exciting match in prospect nonetheless. I'm Derek Ray and joining me for commentary is the former Arsenal defender Lee Dixon. I'm very excited to be able to bring you live coverage from the Scottish Premiership, it's coming right up. It's St Mirren up against Celtic. Thanks Derek, yeah really looking forward to both teams producing entertaining football, let's see if we get that. This is how it looks for the home side. A standard 4-4-2, a formation you know well from your playing days, Lee. Yeah, I like this formation, Derek. It's very, very important that when they haven't got the ball, they all stick together. Very solid look about it. When they don't have the ball, very important that they stay close together in midfield. The back four will link across the width of the pitch, but they've got to help the forwards. The two up front need width. Here's the Celtic starting 11. And you tend to know what you're going to get tactically from this team. High pressing. Well, high pressing, high energy. I played this system at Arsenal many a year under George Graham. It doesn't half work when it works well. Sometimes you can just get exposed to the back, but they've got it down to a tee, to be fair. Thank you. Enjoy the game. The game commences. Brown. Throw ins given. Waters. An unforced error, you've got to say. Oh dear, I think he's left his shooting boots behind in the dressing room. Well, it was well worth the effort. Poor technique, really. Should do better than that. <laughs> Flynn. Given the ball away unnecessarily. Brown. Now with Ryan Christie. Christie. Forrest. And moving the ball nicely. And Edouard with it. Must score! Wonderful block. Flynn, racing forward, trying to catch them out. They need to get bodies back. A really committed challenge, and it's gone out for a throw-in. The delivery. Well, the cross that time completely overcooked. Forrest. Scott Brown. Well, that is a defender's job to come to the rescue. A good-looking move. Well, they must exercise caution standing off as they are. McGregor. Real chance. Attacker versus keeper, and keeper wins. Oh, I always put my money on the attacker. Not this time. Brilliant goalkeeping. <laughs> but he's gone short with it. But he made that interception look routine. In truth, it wasn't.
Couldn't keep it. It's opening up for them. Well, just couldn't keep himself onside. McGregor, Christie, Forrest, it's there for him, the first goal of the match, and the lead certainly doesn't flatter them. It's taken a while, but the pressure has taken its toll. Well, here is the replay, and to be fair, the keeper from that distance hasn't got much chance of keeping it out. Lovely goal. Well, let's take another look at that goal, shall we? So the match has restarted, 1-0 here. Forrest. Christie. El Yunusi. Alas, a wild, wild attempt. Well, after that effort, I'm not sure whether he's right or left-footed. And Edouard with it. Now he must favour the cross, attending to his defensive chores. He's given it away. Can they trouble the opposition this time? Scott Brown. McGregor. On the ball, Mohamed Elianusi. Well, they're sitting ever deeper. We've been waiting to find out. Now we know a minimum of three added minutes here. Well, they keep working away, looking for passing lanes. That is a very fine challenge in difficult circumstances. Well, the managers will now deliver their half-time team talks. We're at the end of 45 minutes in this game. Well, this man will get most of the plaudits for his contribution up to this point, Lee. Well, Derek, it certainly was a good 45 minutes from the lad. Obviously got the goal to give him the lead, but he's looked very, very lively as well. The two teams have switched around and are ready now for the second half. On the ball, Mohamed El Yunusi. El Yunusi. A very attractive looking move, easy on the eye, but nothing there. Ayer. Here's McGregor. On the ball, Mohamed El Yunusi. And he's taken it away. Illegal play, and hence a free kick. Really good reading of the game to win possession back. Callum McGregor. That's a lovely ball. McGinn. Flynn. Broadfoot.
wonderful block. And a throw in forthcoming. They've decided that now is the time to go to the bench. Foley. Tremendous block. Danger averted. What can he do from here? Pretty routine there for the goalkeeper. Well, Derek, the stats tell you everything. Slim pickings out there, not created enough. I can't see them getting back in this game unless their forwards up their game a little bit. Flynn. It's a weighted pass. Staunch rear guard action. Well, he'd be disappointed if he didn't take that one cleanly. Foley. Possession one. That is excellent pressure high up the pitch. Well, they know how to press, but can they construct? Both managers deciding this is the time to change things around. Both teams going to the bench. Executed. Couldn't keep it. Oh, a nice looking pass. This looks promising. And putting his body on the line. Inside the last quarter of an hour. And scope for them to produce something exciting. And a half baked clearance. Dealing with the threat that was real. Here's McGregor. Well, they're doing a fine job of applying pressure here, not giving their opponents time to think or get out of their own half. Well, they've got to give just a little bit more. The fans are demanding it. They could get themselves back into this one. Hudson Edouard. Well, he's got plenty of space on the flank here. It was a fine-looking attack, but now they've given the ball away. Well, the cross that time completely overcooked. He's got to score! Straightforward piece of goalkeeping. Christie. And there's the feed into the box. We've had the official word. There will be a minimum of two added minutes. Foley, Flynn. They are making headway, but really they need a goal with time not on their side. And there goes the final whistle. I think it's accurate to say, Lee, that this man was the light bringer for his side. He's always a man to watch for the opposition, but they couldn't keep tabs on him in that vital moment when he grabbed that goal.